Welcome aboard my brand new vlog series. I'm so glad to have you here. My family and I spent the most incredible week aboard P&O Cruises Iona on a tour of the Norwegian fjords. Iona is pretty wowy with 14 restaurants, 19 bars and cafes, theatre, cinema, library, whirlpools, infinity pool, hydrotherapy pool, the Sky Dome, its own gin distillery, fantastic kids club, huge spa and extremely comfortable cabins. This ship is something special. I hope these vlogs give you a good taste of what a cruise is like. It was our first ever cruise and we were blown away by it. I can't wait to show you the ship, the food, the excursions and just a bit of happy mum life with two little girls. If you have any questions at all, leave them below. But until then, give this video a thumbs up and enjoy the vlogs. Good morning from cabin 9604. I've put a little um, microphone on you, so hopefully that means we can come out here and be in windy conditions, as I can see, um, but that it won't affect the sound too much. Um, just thought I'd show you the view. Gorgeous. And now we're gonna go and get some breakfast. So we've come down to the Keys for breakfast. It's just so close to our room. We've got the girls sorted. They have got, what have you got for breakfast, Pearly? Pancakes. What have you got on your pancakes? <laughs> Chocolate. Nutella and strawberries. We're gonna get you a drink in a second. Why do you have like a funny thing on the phone? A fluffy thing, it's a microphone. Oh. <laughs> Stops it from being like yeah, in the wind. And that's our view, not a bad view, eh girls? In the middle of the sea. Of the sea. Right, I'm gonna go get my breakfast. So I've got a full English sort of setup. I have got a couple of hash browns for the girls as well. Uh, but they also have all your normal like continental pastry things. And they also have like yogurty bits and fresh fruit over here. That looks nice, that medley. Uh, what have we got here? What's this? Oh, like butters and jams and rolls. Amazing. Just can't get over how beautiful the sea is. Off to Kids Club, here's the outside of it. Here's this one. Look how safe this all feels. Yeah, I like that that's high like you can still get nice little shots gaps but i like i like that that's really high bye pearly she's off bye see you later bye gorgeous so that was the first time either darcy or pearl have gone to a kids club um but they went pearl went in like no problems darcy was like a little bit nervous but she's gone in so i'm gonna go down now to meet liam at the spa That's an example of one of the rooms. Look at the view. The camera's not doing it justice, but that's lovely. Here we go. So we're just in the little relaxation room, filling in our form about our treatment. So this is mine and Liam's treatment room. We're going to have a hot stone massage. Looks lovely in here. Oh, that's going to be a nice angle. <laughs> My goodness, that was so nice. Like, I don't usually, well, I never fully relax. I'm just in the change room, there's no one here at the moment. Um, I never fully, fully relax. So I'm just not a relaxed person, but I could feel myself just, I don't think I'm fully relaxed, but I don't know anyone that could get me to that fully relaxed state. Oh my goodness, how many times I want to say relaxed? Um, but I feel like quite blissful, quite zen, more relaxed than I normally am. Um, so I'm just going to put my stuff in a little lock here and then I'm going to go and use the hydrotherapy um, space. It's like a pool and relaxation space. I'm going to take my phone in and if there's nobody in there I'll film but obviously if there's people in there relaxing I won't. Um, but yeah, what a great start to any trip. Every trip should start with a couple's massage. Also, if you've never been for a couple's massage, which I have never, um, it's you just it's two of you in a room and there's two therapists like I, I wasn't sure like would we talk to each other like would anything happen um, but we didn't talk to each other we just were in the room but I was quite comforted to know he was there so um, that was really nice. Well that was absolutely lovely and now I'm all dressed and freshened up. I'm gonna go and get the girls. Hello, we're having some lunch. How was Kids Club? Look at that face. How was Kids Club, Pearly? Oh, that looks 
looks a bit nice. It's all about the chocolate cake. That looks delicious. Yours nice. And you've made some things. Yeah, it's good, Pearly. What's this? Hi. Hooray! Hooray! Do you want to put it on? No? <laughs> nah. And you've also made us this postcard. Are these jellyfish or is it an octopus? The one with no eyes is an octopus. Yeah, that's an octopus. And the one with eyes is an octopus. Um, jellyfish. Jellyfish. So good. Thank you. Oh, hello, babe. Thank you very much. That's good timing. Yum. Um, and probably make a boat. Yeah. I thought Kids Come was very good, and I'll go again. Yeah, what did you like about it? It was air hockey. Yeah? Yeah. I'll just show you the view from our table. Look at that. Oh, even better. Yeah. You just made the view so much better. <laughs> Salim has brought me over a treacle, treacle sponge with custard. Not top of the Treacle sponge with cloth. Golden syrup sponge cake. Salim has brought me over a golden syrup sponge, golden syrup sponge cake. Say that quickly five times. We'll do a little taste test. Let's spill it. Cheers. I'm not going to. It's so nice. I'm not usually a cake person, but that is delicious. I'll make the exception for that. It's a bit later on, and as you can see, I'm looking more than a bit dishevelled. Um, Mrs. I don't ever relax. Turns out that that hot stone full body massage experience did relax me because after lunch we came up to the rooms just to get freshened up, and I said, "Oh, I'm just gonna lay down for 20 minutes and have like a little disco nap." Two hours later, <laughs> I woke up. I've had the most lovely nap. Liam took the girls to the cinema. They were playing Encanto today, so they went to do that, and they're all back now. Um, they're just in Liam's room. Um, we have filmed a bit of a reel out on the um, balcony there. I've had to like bring the furniture in. Hang on, there you go. <laughs> Darcy wanted to do the Chasina. It's the, I got the shoes, I got the dress, jobby. So that might already be on Instagram for you. Um, but it's celebration night, black tie night, gala night, whatever you want to call it, um, tonight. So, we are all going to be looking lovely. So I'm going to start sorting myself out. I'm going to transform from this into something, hopefully, a bit more put together. And that's your little update. I'm just really enjoying this. It's so unlike me to go at this pace. Like, it's unlike me to give in to a nap. I don't normally nap on holidays, um... I'm just enjoying the like the pace of things it's really lovely and also I'm talking to you but really I'm just looking at that view I just can't get over how beautiful that is I'm excited to see how the view changes in the coming days thought I would just show you something I bought especially for the cruise that if you come on a cruise might be handy it is this hook on the back of the bathroom door makeup bag when it's all zipped up it all folds up like so here we are, and that bit obviously tucks in as well. I haven't even taken the tag off. I actually just bought this on Amazon. Um, but it's so good because you just whip it on the back of the door and then you leave yourself plenty of counter space in there. So, yeah, if you're going on a trip where you don't have a lot of space, this has been great so far. Another thing I'll show you whilst I'm being helpful, and really I should be getting ready, but um, something I bought was a lanyard with um, a little pocket on. You get these little cards, and they are the keys to your room. They also do the electricity in your room, and also you can pay for things and book things and book your children in and out of Kids Club. Basically, you need these a lot. Um, so I have really enjoyed having it on lanyard. Something to consider if you've got a lanyard at home, bring it. If not, order one. I suppose they probably sell them here. Have a look around the shops yet, maybe we'll do that later, probably not later, maybe tomorrow. Anyway, let's go and get ready. Ta-da! I am ready, my gorgeous, gorgeous girls I am ready. are ready. <laughs> Wait until you see I Liam. Can't. Who is this? Who is this? So suave, so elegant. It's that man from um, top, the like, the agent that like shoots and stuff and has a suit on James him. Bond. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I have had a slight wardrobe slash body malfunction. My foot at the moment is having some problems. Um, so I cannot wear my high heels that I bought. So I'm wearing my gold uh, flippy floppy. I don't even know if that's in shop. Um, but you know, they're gold and sparkly. So hopefully that will still be okay. I feel like it's wonky, it's so wonky. 
You just do it as straight as yeah. you can then. Just straight as you can. He can do some moves because I'm filming. Okay, oh, you're filming. Thanks, Pearl. So we're eating in the Opal restaurant this evening. This looks a bit lovely. Liam's just checking us in. And can't get over how smart you look. <laughs> Darcy, you look so gorgeous. And Pearly looks gorgeous. Is there a little smile in there? A tiny smile? <laughs> Do it then. <laughs> I've stolen her smiles. Is there a little smile? Not today. All right then. Oh, Darcy's got all the smiles. Darcy noticed something about the napkins. Oh. <laughs> And Pearl noticed it too. What have you noticed, Lossie? This is a ship. The shape of a ship, yeah. What a nice little touch. So I have gone for the fried goat's cheese croutin or croutin with apple and red cabbage puree as my starter. That's really nice. That's really nice. So next up I've gone for the homemade porcini mushroom and roasted garlic ravioli which is a fried quail's egg, asparagus spears and a truffle beurre blanc which is this one here, I hope I've said that correctly. Pearly's got a trick for us. Yeah. Whoa. Where have they gone? Completely. Whoa. Oh my god. Whoa, they came back. What? This is too much. This is mind blowing. Good trick. So we're in the main atrium, they've got a photo opportunity there, got a grand piano, doing magic music, Pearl was just dancing then, no 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 don't go on it sweetie, I think we might just find a little area to sit and relax. That's my view, I've got a glass of fizz, I just sat in the atrium, look at this and I was queuing over there to have a photo by the staircase um, but Liam is queuing now and I'm just sat down enjoying the view and then we'll, we'll swap, we'll swip swap and the girls are in cute curves so cheers to you yep. one two three it's magic what okay that's amazing thank, thank you, you so <laughs> sit quickly So when I travel, I like to have my own weather lady to tell me what's going on. So I've brought Laura Tobin, weather lady, with me on my travels. Uh, no, Laura's actually here doing talks. But yeah, she's here, she's doing a talk on the ship about her new book. Plug your new book. Everyday ways to save our planet. If you want to know how to save the planet, show you when to start. This book is the perfect place. This book is for you now. Now try that drink. It's flavoursome. I don't like things that taste alcoholic. So this tastes. Oh well, then you're not going to like that at all. No, no, I like things that are fruity and not alcoholic tasting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> balcony, here's the deck, and here's the town. Just had to do a little bathroom selfie because look how cute we look. 
Little gorgeous girls, gorgeous, gorgeous girls. Deuce to banger. Yep. Here's Daddy waiting. Liam and Darcy have just gone to go and get a couple of things from the rooms. So we've just wandered into the atrium. Oh, I just thought I'd share it with you. We're having a little photo shoot down there. It's beautiful, isn't it? So we have to be back on at 4.30. Let's go. So there's the ship. And then how gorgeous are these little houses. I keep sending Marie pictures and videos, you know my friend Marie in Seattle, because Norway is her vibe. And I keep saying, you could have this one, and I'll have that one, and imagining us living here. As you know, little cutie towns is very my thing. So I think I'm gonna really enjoy this. Whoa, it's a nice shot of the cruise just there. Look at this gorgeous little garden. This place is like a fairy tale. Oh, everywhere you look, every little nook and cranny is just lovely. I feel like fairies and magical creatures live here amongst humans in this just happy, blissful fairy tale. I mean, for goodness sake, it's a tiny little water feature. You could make wishes in there that would definitely come true. Is that nice? Is it refreshing? No, I want to touch the magical water. Yeah, it feels really magical. Do you see that? Oh, it is nice. It does feel nice. I wonder if this was made for like animals to drink out of in the olden days, or if it's for humans. Or if people took their hands in. <sighs> Little milk thing, for goodness sake. It's cuteness upon cuteness. So there's another view of Iona. And then we swing around to this beautiful little town. <laughs> the girlies. These gorgeous houses and gardens. with the cruise you pay a bit extra for those or you can just disembark when you're at shore and just explore on your own that's what we're doing today oh my goodness the view is beautiful I'll show you this in one second in fact I'll just show you it now just a casual beautiful park with a giant fountain and swans and gorgeous buildings all around no big deal no big deal so I was saying we are just exploring today um, and we really enjoy the little town little the oldie part of the town with the white houses and now we are looking for the bus stop for the hop on hop off tour bus um, someone last night in the atrium said that's a really good thing to do here um, and apparently it's about 40 minutes to do a loop um, so we're gonna do that and see some sights we found a sweets and candy shop. We're gonna go and have a look in here. I've not seen strawberry Kit Kats before. I don't know if this is a specialist shop with like, you know, sweets from all around the world or a particularly Nor Norwegian one. We get those. But we don't get strawberry flavored sherbet fountains. What are you getting, Darcy? Pick a mix. Oh, okay. I'm not allowed to eat them. Pop it back then. Look at these, they look like little tennis balls. Can you get it? <laughs> That's it, keep trying. Oh, she might need a bit of help there. That's it, you did it. Well done. Well, we are on a little <laughs> bus tour. I've met a viewer. What's your name? I'm Ruth. This is Ruth. Ruth, Ruth. Ruth. yeah. This is Ruth. She's reading my book at the moment. <laughs> I am. <laughs> and we're having a look at the uh, port over there. I'm going to see what's all there. So we hopped off our hop on, hop off bus tour. Um, there is Iona over there. 
and I think Liam suggested he'd quite like to go into one of these and just have a beer outside. The children won't have any beers. They've had too many already today, so they'll probably just have a juice, but you know what I mean. <laughs> that doesn't, whoa, that doesn't look like that's a bad idea at all. <laughs> that was such a Liam thing to do. <laughs> Liam. Cheers to you. Mm -hmm. Why is there a dead mouse on your camera? I've got a little jobby on the top for the for the sound. <laughs> Pearl's found a statue of her daddy. <laughs> Thanks so much. Oh, and there's Liam. <laughs> Thanks, girls. So nice of you. Thank you. So we are back on board the ship now and this is the view from the Horizons um, Buffet restaurant. Isn't that stunning? Something that I've noticed about the stairs is they all have that circular artwork and the stairs in the middle of the ship, which is kind of near where we need to be for our rooms, are grey, grey circles. And then I think it's the front of the ship are red circles and the back of the ship are blue circles. But it's handy because all the lift and stairs areas look almost identical, like they all look like that. So that's just a clever little feature that I thought I'd share with you that I appreciated. It's all about the details for me. Got your balance very precariously on a shelf, a loo roll, a packet of tissues and my bronzer, ever the professional. Um, we've had a lovely, lovely couple of hours the girls requested to go back to kids club like i have spent my entire parenting life never putting my children in kids club don't get me wrong i don't ever judge anybody that puts their kids in kids club it's not it's not a matter of like i think that they shouldn't go or anything like that it's just that i have like a few issues with oh God, let me jump how long have you been sitting there for ages oh i was just saying that i don't ever put you in kids club do i because I worry, I get a bit worried about things, but you've really enjoyed it, haven't you? Yeah, it's been good. She's made friends with a couple of girls that go, and she rang them on the... Oh, here's the other one. Hello. What are you, What do you want? The grape, the grape the, a grape. A grape. BRB. The, grape the grape's gone. gone. Honey, yeah. what do you think of the cruise? Great. Oh, don't flick the... Don't flick the camera. It's great, is it? No, don't flick my camera with water. What's great about it? The, the stuff. Yeah, what's your favourite thing? It's when when there's lots of squeeze and toys. You buy me toys, don't you buy me? Mm -hmm. I made a snowdrop on my head. So we have come to the beach house for dinner. Quick look at the menu if you want to pause the screen and have a little look. We've ordered, oh you're looking forward to that aren't you? Yeah. Toasted marshmallow fondue share. We've ordered a pink spritz and a pina colada. I'm gonna have, for, for Liam and I obviously, I think I'm gonna go for the nachos or the chili sin carne which is like vegetarian chili. What have you ordered Darcy? Um, steak and chips. Steak. I love you. <laughs> so Liam's starters arrived, just taken Pearl to the loo. He's got the crap toast starters. <laughs> And I have gone for the nachos. Anytime there's nachos on a menu, I am straight there. And Pearly just had some food from the buffet because that's what she wanted. It's fish and broccoli and garlic bread. And you are just waiting for your no, I'm having steak. I'm having steak. Aren't you? I'm having brown board. Oh, okay. <laughs> long, long, long. <laughs> Look how proud you are of that joke. You're like, hee. Oh my goodness, Darcy. So have sweet cake and fries on the side. Wow! This is a bit special, Doodles. Thank you so much. I have gone for the chili sin carne and Liam just went for something just subtle, just something small. <laughs> Such a lucky woman. Liam, over to you. I said the order of the fish is how they caught it in the day. And I was like, wow, really? That's so cool. He's so proud of himself for tricking me. What a joker. Went, oh, is it really? <laughs> no. I didn't say it with that much gusto. Oh, wow. <laughs> I was impressed. I was like, how did they do that? That's so cool. Such an interesting fact. 
So Liam's gone for a little chocolatey tart thing and the girls have gone for this. <laughs> it's a marshmallow goodies fondue. Hi. And hi, are you excited? Yum, yum, yum. Yummy, yum, yum, yum. <laughs> Hello. That meal was amazing. Where are we going now, Judah? Kids Club! Kids, are you enjoying it? Yes, I really like Kids Club because I always have an occasion to wear something nice. <laughs> Would you rather be hanging out with Mummy and Liam or go to Kids Club? <laughs> she loves it. I don't know why I've waited this long to allow her to go. To look at her, she's like, bye, I'm off. So she's in Kids Club now. Part of me is obviously really happy that she's, um, enjoying it but then there's another part of me that's like oh this is the future isn't it she's not going to always want to spend all of her time with her she's growing up and she's having her own holiday experiences so <laughs> on the ship there is always something going on everywhere you look there's something happening it's so good we just popped out for a quick selfie because look at that view pearls inside with our friends laura and dean Look at that view! We've been really fortunate on this trip that some people that we know are on the ship as well. We haven't come with them, they're just on the ship at the same time, so we've been meeting up a lot, which is lovely. I think you saw, I think I vlogged Laura last night and Kat. Um, so we just bumped into them, so I think we'll watch a little bit of this entertainment and then I'm going to take Pearly to bed. Darcy's going to stay at Kiss Club for a bit. What a lovely day! So, this um, pool here, can you see just there, this pulls out to become a whole stage. And then they do shows with like acrobats hanging down and all sorts of cool stuff in here. Pearly knows where she's off. Have you seen our room yet, Pearly? I think you might have gone past it. Ta-da! And we've got our stuff for tomorrow. This is so handy. Every night they put the next day's bits and pieces in your little pocket there. I don't think that I will ever, ever get tired of that view. Look at that sunset. I've never even seen clouds like that before. Look, there's like a layer and then kind of like a lattice of clouds. Somebody tell me what that's all about. Sat out on the balcony with the love of my life watching the sunset. We're gonna go through the horizon um magazine or leaflet that you get outside your door so we want to make sure that we do everything there's so much to do it's hard to do everything isn't it yeah you've got to plan it in haven't you otherwise yes. you miss out and stuff yes i would say that although it's a very oh, oh drop something although it's a very relaxed experience you could you could just not plan things and just kind of like float and do whatever tickled your pickle but i like to know what i'm doing so I like that they give you that leaflet and tell you what time things are on and what things you need to book and what things you don't. Um, but I would really like to do another show. We saw a show on the first night and that was really good. The girls really loved that. But I wouldn't mind doing another show if pos. We've got some lovely meals booked. We've got a couple of excursions booked like Puno, cruises excursions. Um, so we've got a good few days ahead of us, haven't we? Yeah. I think I'm probably going to wrap this vlog up because um, it's probably getting quite long and I'm conscious that this is, that's going to be a big edit so I might make this into two videos, part one and part two, but I will upload them really close together probably, oh, I don't want to I don't want to commit but like maybe in the same week. <laughs> I'm saying this, I'm like oh don't commit, don't commit, but quickly. Um, but yeah. Such a tease. Oh, such a tease. Thoughts on cruising so far are this is lovely, like really, really lovely. I think my dad would enjoy this. Wouldn't he? Well, we're enjoying it. Yeah, but this is very Stevie P, isn't it? Yeah. Like the atrium, black tie, those drinks with the steam that came up yeah. shows. Like, that's very You're dad. You're treated really nicely. Yeah, it's really yeah. lovely. Um, so, I think I will wrap this vlog up. I'll put anything I forgot in the box or ask any questions. I'm in the comments. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!